It's Saturday morning, folks. And I'm over here at the point. I just wanted to take a ride out here. It's like 8, uh, 8.32. I just wanted to see how many boats they had launched. They don't have as many as I thought they would have. Looks like one of them's even picking up. I think that southwest wind's got them a little messed up. I got one boat behind me trying to go over there and launch. There's one boat over there. That's one, two, three, four, five boats waiting to launch. Two of them tied up in the boat launch. Just like this gentleman came back. Oh, he just came to wash his boat. I don't know what's wrong with the uh, pressure washer. It doesn't work. That's up the flow here. And this is where the St. Tammany uh, Yacht Club is having their rodeo. I sure thought they'd have more boats than this, folks. The lot seems to be pretty full. Just talked to the gentleman that was uh, uh, picked his boat up. He said it's too rough out there. I didn't think it would be that rough, but evidently uh, that's a nice size boat he had to be concerned about the roughness. I think more so probably the people out there. You can't really get what you want to get. I'm gonna take a ride across the uh, Hobby 11 Bridge and see if I can video how many boats we got out there. Well, it does look a little rough out there, folks. And to my surprise, I don't see many boats. But this is just the start of the Highway 11 bridge. Coming up here right now, you can notice a little difference in the, in the bridge, the train bridge. That's a fire break, fire break one. I guess that southwest wind got them uh, concerned about the weather. Yesterday must have had 50 boats right along here. There's one gentleman fishing down there. Two, three, three boats, four boats. Another boat going back in, five boats. Six, seven. Highway uh, 433, water's nice and calm, folks. Got three boats out in the pond. Looking good, looking good. Nope, nobody's launched over here. Nope, got somebody behind me. I 
found all the boats, folks, or the trailers anyway. This is a Wrigley's launch. Uh, the lot, parking lot is full. They, they parked along the highway over here. They parked along the road over there. But the lot here is full, as you can see. They double parking here. I gotta guess a hundred trailers. This is where the local 60 rodeo is going to be at. But I think Wrigley's uh, lots always like this. Now these guys here, I don't know what they're going to do. Because they back into one another. Then I don't know how they're going to get out if they come in early. People getting ready, getting going out. Family affair there, Bo. Oh, there's local 60's rodeo. There's the crew cooking. Here we are. There's all the, all the chefs over there getting ready to cook the jambalaya and all kind of other things they got to offer. Their weigh-in is going to be at 2 p.m. today, so I might try to pass back over here to see who wins the rodeo. But I guess based on what I'm seeing, we're not going to have many participants at the Team Jojo fishing curriculum session today. And I don't blame them, I'd be out fishing too. But uh, we'll have to see, it's still for, still for 11 o'clock, we'll have to see. It's still coming out, folks. I don't know where they're going to park at, but... I still don't know how that's going to work, folks. They got the middle trailers blocked in. One in front, one in back. The only thing I can think of, they left the keys with the, uh, the launch to pull people out the way if somebody wants to leave early. As you can see, all down the highway over there, they have them. Got them lined up all along here. And guess what? They are still still coming out. Uh-oh. Dum, da -dum, dum Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do when they come for you? Woo! They gonna be busy today writing tickets, I can guarantee you.